How's it going everybody, Demic Games here, and once again, thank you for clicking into one of my videos. We are back with our collegiate running back, Mike the Maniac Marshall, and in week one is debuting a 22 attempt, 76 yards, and one touchdown in the run game. And now we are going up against these Red Dragons, and we are going to bump up our carrying just to make sure we do not fumble. Since we are that power back, we're going to get a high dose of the offense, try to get a couple catches into that as well to, like I said previously, be a high volume volume high percentage part of the offense and that is exactly what we're doing early getting in, inside the red zone catching a nice pass trying to power through some defenders as we get our first receiving touchdown of our career and we're happy doing a little bit of dance sitting down in the end zone and now all we got to do is show how much of a man we really are just to get those NFL scouts involved in us. And now we're showing off some speed as Ben's the receiver I could not tell you guys in week one. Number 19, the senior wide receiver, just making sure nobody gets their hands on us as we get an 88-yard touchdown. And we started off so, so strong. And we're just looking to continue this in second and two, getting stuffed a little bit, but third and one, ain't nobody stopping us as he takes two defenders a couple extra yards to make sure he gets that first down. And third and ten, plenty of time in the pocket until there ain't none. Going down for a sack is our sophomore quarterback, Pat Berry, and that is not the UFC Pat Berry, even though that would be pretty cool. But right now, Pat Berry is that sophomore. He is going to have some inexperienced type plays as holding onto the ball for too long. Week one, he did throw an interception. But right now, he's doing pretty dang good as Benz is getting us inside the red zone. And now that they're in this territory, Mike the Maniac Marshall wants to capitalize. And that is exactly what this man is going to do. Getting his second receiving touchdown on the day. Third of the game. And the Maniac is showing no signs of slowing down as he's going to break as many tackles as he possibly can. And this might be a 30 plus carry game as long as we can keep this lead as it should be as long as nothing too drastic happens in terms of pick sixes, fumble recoveries, or special team touchdowns. And right now, 3rd and 11, our man Overton is finally going to show up. I yeah, told you guys we all got to learn their names, especially myself since it is the Maniac Squad is 2nd and 7, not going anywhere. 3rd and 11, we are going to go out for a screenplay. But Pat Berry showing that inexperience, taking a sack, holding it for too long. He should have just tossed it out to Mike the Maniac, kind of like this one, and at least giving him a chance. He stumbles on his own offensive lineman to have a third and ten. Pat Berry looking for something, and once again just does not have the awareness or the experience to get rid of that ball or find an open receiver as Pat Berry. We still got a 21 point lead now into the second half. We just gotta go ahead and kill as much clock as we possibly can. Finding a wide receiver to get this first down the first and 10 back to the run game. Not getting too much after that 88 yard rushing touchdown until we finally gouge and smack the safety, put him on his back and take him out for the next six games with a broken collarbone. I know those pads are supposed to keep your shoulders nice and safe, but apparently you didn't have yours on too tight as, of course, the Maniac, he's going to try to hurt each and every person that tries to put his hands on him. And uh, that's kind of just a showcase of what he can do is we are now inside the red zone trying to get to, into this end zone one yard shy. But of course, we're going to try to pound this one in there. Stopped on third and goal and not what we wanted. We wanted kind of show and prove what kind of running back we are being 240 pounds we are a pure power running back we got to go ahead and convert and get into the end zone on those we still have a lead but we got to take advantage whenever we get that chances wish we had a little bit more speed outrun that man but these red dragons looking like they're on their last breath here using their timeouts to stop us second and ten gonna go ahead and clinch this victory of course, they're still down by quite a few points, but just to solidify it, we're going to go ahead and get the last first down that we needed. And now they're trying to strip the ball just to be, you know, they're trying to get that first fumble on Mike Maniac's career. But it ain't going to happen this game as we get back-to-back -back victories. Hopefully you guys enjoyed the video. Obviously, we had 
a 30 attempt game, over 200 yards, 5 receptions, and 2 receiving touchdowns, and we are proving to be that high percentage of the offense. And be sure to let me know down in the comment section below what you guys are liking about the series. Be sure to hit that thumbs up as well and subscribe if you like the content because I want to be a highly replying commentator. I love the feedback from you guys. I want to reply each and every time I get the chance. And until next time, everybody, Demo Games out.